you could make the case for him being the very first graduate of the school. Uh, and so I think that's a great way to start a conversation about alumni and where they've gone is where have they been from the beginning. And, and the thing that was interesting about him and his relationship with the school is he actually joined our team before we were a school. It was, uh, you know, we, we all, the, 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 the School of Public Health emerged from the College of Medicine, which is not unlike what happens in other places. And uh, so it all came out of preventive medicine. And, and he was in a, uh, a uh, clinical investigative sciences uh, program that was in the preventive medicine group at, at the medical school. And that was the year that we were transitioning into building the public health school. And so he moved over with us. Matt began by, uh, right after high school, entering the Coast Guard and uh, serving the nation in that capacity. And uh, shortly thereafter, uh, found that he was in service in the Middle East in the uh, Desert Storm operation, where he received a commendation medal for his service. Uh, he found thereafter that he uh, wanted to get into the healthcare arena and became an emergency medical technician, a paramedic, and then uh, gradually moved into health department activities and uh, decided that he needed additional training beyond that to, to reach his maximum potential. Uh, enrolled here at the School of Public Health Information Sciences and got both a master's degree and PhD that allowed him to reach a new level of expertise that he applied very quickly. He uh, has worked in the public health service, he's worked at the state level, he's worked locally in the local health department, so he's worked at all three levels of public health. Um, but he's also engaged in, in academic pursuits, he's, he's taught courses here or uh, guest lectures. He's done scholarly product related to some of the work that he's done. He's done field-based research. He's done bench-based research. Matt, he presents the complete package. Uh, he is a, a scientist, I think, at heart. He is a servant, a public servant. He's an educator, um, and he is a very selfless individual. Congratulations to Dr. Lieutenant Commander Matt Grunwald. Uh, we're very excited to have you represent us this year in the Alumni uh, uh, Awards. And, and we're looking forward to working with you down the road. It's truly an honor to be named the 2016 Alumni Fellow of the Louis University of Louisville School of Public Health and Information Sciences. I wasn't born here, but my family and I have lived here for the past 18 years, and I'm proud to call Louisville my adopted hometown. My association with Louisville's signature university as a student, a fa an adjunct faculty member, and as an alumnus have always been a major source of that sense of pride. The practice of public health is ultimately about improving people's lives and making the communities that they live in and work in safer and healthier. Um, and I'm grateful to the University of Louisville for the outstanding education I received uh, and for the opportunity uh, that it's afforded me to work in such a rewarding field. I'd like to thank Dean Blakely and the entire faculty of the uh, School of Public Health and Information Sciences um, for the honor of this award uh, and for the opportunities they've always been willing to afford me uh, to remain engaged with the school, its faculty, and its students. Uh, the opportunity to share with and learn from the School of Public Health community enriches my career and improves my practice. Finally, I'd also like to recognize all of my fellow graduates of the University of Louisville School of Public Health and Information Sciences, who by preventing illness and promoting and protecting the health of people and communities in Louisville, the United States, and around the world, uh, extend um, not only the impact, but also the best traditions of the University of Louisville in a way that we can all be proud of.